So Nixon is in the hizzy and he's bogarting all my whiskey. Look at him with his greasy chicken fingers on that bottle. You could even not only major dick, but he could be whiskey dick. Anyways, what are we doing? It's 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 off grid and whiskey. Yes, here at the Sasquatch. And it is the Bigfoot Book Club, everybody. I'm gonna review the author of about six books. His name is in Backwards Vision, Trayvonian with a 25 cent discount from the book club. Best 25 cent book of my entire life right here. I, this is probably my 10th copy of The Iger Sanction. That's how the actor said it in the movie. Trayvonian, in his life, he's dead, deader than Kelsey's nuts. I'll get to that in a minute. Nixon, that's Nixon's favorite line, by the way, when he was in the White House. In the movie, George Kennedy, the actor, he said deader than Kelsey's net. So there is a connection here with Nixon, Major Dick, and Trayvonian here. If you were stranded on a desert island, what book, one book, would you have? It would be the Iger Sanction. Easily, hands down. But you could do Shai Bumi by Trayvonian. You could do The Summer of Katya by Trayvon. Look at that. I've used this. This is my third copy of this one, and I'm duct taping it now. There's Shibumi again. I've got like 50 copies. Every time I see these books, Trayvonian books, I just buy. His first novel ever, 1972. He was a, he was a um, art, a movie professor at the University of Texas, and he wrote a book as a joke, a spoof to James Bond. So he did an American version with the lead character, Jonathan Hemlock. Huge hit, sold millions out of the gate. His publisher, I guarantee this happened. Well, I know it did. They had him on contract to write at least one more. And they're just salivating going, oh my, walnut wallet, are you dog styling me? You need to be the next writer of all these James Bond type books for the America, because it was, people love it. He said, no. Any other author would have just shoved this stuff right down our throats and fast. I mean, look at, here, great example, John Grisham. Boom, he just came out with a, a time to kill. Here you go, you got the jury, you got blah, blah, blah. Every Tom Cruise formula movie, you know, they're all the same. To me, every John Grisham book is the same. He's a terrible writer, but um, it just... He stuck with that genre. That's great. That's fine with me. I have no problem. Lots of authors do. Nicholas Sparks. The Notebook. He, uh, okay, well, right now he's on the Notebook part 150, you know. He's not going to explore different genres and try something new. That's what's great about Trayvonian. He, it's the last thing he wanted to do was write more of these. He went and wrote this. I like to leave people a little richer for having known me or read me. And let me tell you, you are going to be richer for reading Trayvonian. His real name is Rodney Whitaker, by the way. He went to the University of Washington for his master's. No, his PhD, I believe. So there's a little, I'm in Washington State. Just to, Not that I'd hang out at UW, you know, I was more of a Washington State University person, WSU. Uh, Beer Bust, 92. Beer Blitz, 91. That was a continuation of Beer Blitz 86, 91. And so there's a lot of uh, scars hanging out at WSU. Anyways, I digress, especially below the waist. Um, so I'm not kidding you. I know what I'm talking about when it comes to Trayvonia. Look at me. I was the customer of the month, September 2019, at my local hardware store. So I know what I'm saying here. I like how he bucked the system. Here's a little relation. I can relate to that. This channel, Off Grid and Whiskey. My biggest, they have an analytics section I can look at. Um, out of the almost 300 videos I've done. Oh, hands down. Easy Boardwalk Jr. I got thousands of views on Easy Boardwalk Jr. So everybody on YouTube will tell you, there's your genre right there. Boom. That's what you should do. Make your channel as easy boardwalk junior. It's all you do is mill all day. Steve guitar mill. Uh, so I can relate to Trayvonian. No, I am not. I don't want to do that. I want to make a doobie with Adobe. 
it's just ridiculous and out there. But uh, I enjoy that. And I don't care what the analytics tell me and how many subscribers I get. I just don't give a rip. So I have all these different subgenres of off-gridding and milling that uh, I would rather explore that and and have fun. That to me is fun. I guarantee that's what Trevanian thought too. It's like, you know, that's not fun to me, writing that same Jonathan Hemlock novel. All right, Major Dick out. <laughs> Ooh, that did not sound good. <laughs> that even made me laugh. Out. See, I'm not going to go mill. Well, I probably will right now. <laughs> Major Dick out. I like that. That was a good one. That one that's beyond me on that one. I did, really didn't think about it too much. Just major dick out.